So in certain types of engineering practices, there is this idea that the computer and mathematics itself are sort of a-cultural, right? That they just exist in, in their own technical and formal world. Well, every computer system is built within the social and historical context of its time. I coined the term phantasmal media to describe the sense that computational media can be used to express rich mental imagery. So in literary arts, uh, we have kind of rich worlds that are constructed, rich imaginative worlds that people can explore and enter. At the same time, other, uh, other art forms have really engaged the human condition and have really thought about issues of ideology. How do you change ideology? How do you construct ideology through constructing uh, meaning and media? Well, phantasmal gets at both of those kind of concerns because phantasmata in cognitive science has been used to describe mental images, and in literary arts, we've used the term phantasmal to describe the kind of social illusions that exist that we all somehow submit to. You could say, in, in a nutshell, we want to be able to destigmatize uh, uh, users, look at the way stigma is built into systems, and uh, do uh, better, and then also to be able to empower users to more exp expressively uh, self-represent. Lost Under Sea is an interactive narrative uh, artwork, or kind of interactive, poetic, uh, AI-based artwork, in, in which you have a character that's falling f further and further uh, under the sea. Well, falling into the sea is a kind of metaphor for uh, everyday life. Well, as a character moves to that space, they have a choice of different kind of actions to undertake. Each of those choices is imbued with a certain kind of emotional tone or emotional power. So the poetry is uh, generated based on an AI uh, algorithm built into a system called Grio that, that I created. And that poetry has a different emotional disposition based on the actions that the person has taken. No matter what medium we're dealing with, whether it's a gaming or a social media, we're interested in using the power of the medium to convey uh, meaning differently each time to help people to become more empowered and critically aware of the social and cultural issues that they're engaged in. Devour, bullying and striving, morning diner, in the morning, an Atlantean aroma. I get up from my work desk often, but I want to procrastinate. We can take a step back, use the immense wisdom that comes from the humanities and, and from the arts, and then say, how can we do this better?